Hey everybody, welcome back to Papa's Toy Shop. I'm Papa, and uh, I've got a good got a good video for you today. Got a couple mystery boxes. Got a box that I have no clue what's in it. Um, I ordered it from some website, and I don't remember ordering it. <laughs> so I sh it showed up, and uh, it's not. I, it's definitely not a Funko Pop, so I don't know what's in it. But we'll open it up and find out. So I got a couple of good uh, couple good mystery boxes today. Um, I think one of them is from GameStop, so we'll do that one first. And then I have another mystery box for, uh, uh, just please excuse me if I mess up your name, uh, Nishanth from over in India. Uh, this one is a Pop King Paul mystery box. Um, he just must have the luck of the draw to be able to grab one. I've tried to grab Pop King Paul 20 different times and I can't ever get through. I mean, as soon as it's available, I'll click on it, get it in my cart, and by the time I check out, it's gone. So, um, so anyway, we got that Pop King Paul to, to come up at the end of the video. So, without further ado, here we go. So, we're going to start with this one from GameStop. I'm pretty sure this is the Dragon Ball Z mystery box that just came out. I uh, just ordered it. I think that's what's in here. And we're going to open it up and check it out. If I remember right, I think there's four different pops that you can get out of this mystery box. Yep, this is the Dragon Ball Z mystery box. It has nutrition facts on the back, which is kind of odd, but I think it's because there's a there's a Pez dispenser in here, so they're putting the nutrition for the candies. So, all right, here we go. This is the mystery box. Let's open it up and take a look and see what's inside. I open every single one of these boxes I get. It's like I said, I don't collect. And uh, a lot of people don't want to buy the whole box. They just like to get what's inside. So I always open it up and uh, that way I have the stuff available for, for people. All right. So it opens from the top. And all right. First thing we have is uh, the Frieza. There's two pins in here. Looks like Frieza and Perfect Cell is what's in there. If you can see those, I'll try to get them out of the glare. Those are some pretty neat looking pins. Um, I had the Frieza one, the glow and dark Frieza one here, right here somewhere. Yeah, right here. So he definitely, or the glow in the dark Perfect Cell, yeah, that's definitely him in there. I don't know if you can see the it's a resemblance, so put him back. Of course, he's for sale. Set the pen there. Then we have a uh, glow in the dark fourth form Frieza uh, keychain. Hopefully, it's not too much glare on there so you can see what it is. It's a glow in the dark keychain. Looks pretty cool. I know the Frieza's are pretty popular, the black eye and the red eye Frieza's and stuff like that. So we also have a Frieza Force patch. It's not a sticker, it's an actual patch that you would you know, sew onto a jacket or something. That's really pretty cool. I haven't seen them uh, put patches in the mystery boxes yet. So we got Frieza Force patch. Then we also have a Mecha Frieza uh, Pez dispenser. It says GameStop exclusive on it. I think the Pez's are really pretty cool. I've got a bunch of them. Um, I have them set up at my flea market booth over there on uh, at Relics Antique Mall at uh, Kansas and Battlefield. Uh, it's it's pretty. I got a pretty good amount of stuff in there. My my family has been really helpful in getting it all set up because you know with my uh, disability it's hard for me to get around and. Uh, be able to move stuff so I really depend on my wife and kids to help me out and they've been such a huge help on everything so we have the Pez dispenser and the pop comes out of here is Majin Buu with chocolate bar and now I may be pronouncing that name wrong as I'm not a fan of Dragon Ball Z I don't really know anything about it the only anime that uh, I watch is the My Hero Academia with my daughters so there we go. We have the Majin Buu with chocolate bar. I don't know for sure um, 
if this is a rare one or, or if it's one that's everybody's getting or what but there we go let's set him over to the side all right now this is that mystery box that i received that i don't remember buying uh, it's from a company called grab deals and uh i'll put their name and uh, website up at the bottom of the screen there if anybody's interested in it it almost sounds like a puzzle or something that's in there so let's open it up and see what's in there oh it's not a puzzle first thing we have is a box of sweet tarts okay <laughs> I hope I didn't pay too much for this Huh. Anyway, box of sweet tarts. So there we go. I mean, I like sweet tarts, but uh, seems kind of odd for a mystery box. So anyway, there we go. <laughs> All right, now we're here for what everybody's been waiting for. This is the Pop King Paul mystery box. Uh, from my friend Nishanth over in India. He sent it to me to uh, open it up and show it on air and then uh, once it's done I'll get it packaged up and mailed over to him. So let's take a look and see what we got from Pop King Paul. I, I don't know how much the mystery box was. I don't know what run or anything that came, came from. He didn't tell me that. He just told me he had one on the way for me. So let's open her up and see what's inside. I know Pop King Paul has always been fantastic in their mystery boxes. Um, I watch a lot of videos on YouTube, you know, from uh, especially Clint over there at Franchise Kicks. He uh, he gets a lot of these these uh, Pop King Paul boxes. I don't know how he does it either, unless he's a good friend with friend of his and said, "Hey, when you got one to sell, just send me one." So, but uh, we'll take a look and see what we got. First of all, we got the bubble wrap. We got one in a pot protector. It's a soft protector. Still not looking. And there we go. It says anti venom on the back. And this is the Hot Topic anti venom uh, from Marvel. He's pretty cool looking. I know he's very popular. I mean, anything venom is popular. Uh, but I know uh, anti-venom is a pretty cool pop so give you a look around on it let's take her out and take a look at the condition of the box I have to say I'm not very impressed with the pop protector it's it's dirty and all scratched up and everything and it's pretty flimsy so but the box itself The box itself appears to be mint. I don't see any. I don't think see anything wrong with it. So I guess the protector did, did its job. Um, I'm a big fan of the seven bucks a pop uh, pop armor uh, soft protectors, and of course their their uh, um, pop armor. You know, and the 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 ones in the thick acrylic. You know, they're really really good. The hard stacks. That's what I'm trying to think of. My mind just doesn't seem to want to work sometimes. But uh, yeah, they they make the best that I'm that I think that out there. Um, there's other ones that are, are decent, but for the price, I think seven bucks a pop has the best. But all right, well let's take a look and see if we have some values on any of this stuff. We'll take a look here at anti venom. Anti-Venom is vaulted from 2015. And it is showing he has a current value, PPG value, of $16. So set him to the side. Let's check and see if there's any value on this one yet. I know it's pretty new, so it may not have a value yet, but we'll take a look and see. Yeah, it doesn't even show up on the on the pop price guy yet because it's still just way too new so uh, probably be the same thing for everything else yeah he's not showing up either so 
All right, well, there we go. We've got the from the game from the GameStop uh, Dragon Ball Z mystery box. We have the Majin Buu with chocolate bar. We have the um, Mecha Frieza Pez. We got the fourth form Frieza glow in the dark keychain. Got the Frieza Force patch, and then we have the two pins, which is the uh, the Frieza and the Perfect Cell. Here. Uh, we got the box of candy from <laughs> from Grab Deals, which I don't know. I'll enjoy the candy, so I guess that's all there is to it. And then we had the Pop, Pop King Paul uh, mystery box for Nishans. We had the uh, anti-venom pop for him. So we'll get it packed up and sent over to, to him over in India. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you're a return subscriber, I really appreciate you coming back and supporting me. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please click the subscribe button, and uh, that way you can keep up on my videos. Please also give me a thumbs up like if you like the video. Uh, make some comments down below. Tell me what I need to change, what I'm doing good, what I suck at, you know, whatever. So uh, I really appreciate you guys coming out. Um, Thank you for watching the video, and I hope you guys have a great day.